I love it. It's got that spring flair to it. Mm -hmm. So does our weather here in Northern California. We've had temperatures that have soared. Yesterday, we officially did it. We reached our first 80 degree temperature of the year in downtown Sacramento. And what's interesting is when you look back at when we've done that first 80 degree reading before, typically that happens in late March. So we are trending a little bit later than the average. And last year, for perspective, April 10th, so today was the first official day that we actually reached that 80 degree reading. We are still looking at widespread 80s, but they're not going to last for too long. And keep in mind their perspective, the average for this time of year is 72. We're going to be running a little warmer today and tomorrow with the peak of our warmth on Thursday at 84. Then watch this. We trend down to the 60s for the weekend. You're probably wondering, well, what's going to give us to give that cooler air and bring down those temperatures? I'll show you that in just a moment with future cast. But for today, Plan for again a comfortable morning, low 70s by lunchtime in the valley, hitting that high of 82 around 3 to 4 p.m. In the foothills, your day looks like this. We're looking at upper 50s at 9 a.m., mid to upper 60s by lunchtime. Daytime highs peaking in the lower to mid 70s, and we will see sun and clouds around, especially in the Sierra. Lunchtime temperature 53 after starting out the morning below freezing. Daytime highs will push to the lower 60s in spots like South Lake Tahoe and Truckee. Now, looking ahead at things, again, peak of our warmth is tomorrow as that area of high pressure is still close enough to us to help keep the warmth around, but it does start to back down and break down as we head into your Friday. This system will drop down from north to south, and this one derived from the Gulf of Alaska, so it does have the cooler air with it. That'll turn on the onshore breeze as we go through Friday. Friday looks like a dry day in the forecast, but by Saturday, we're going to have to keep an eye on this system for the timing and evolution of it to bring the chance for showers our way and also more snowfall to the mountains for Saturday and Sunday. And again, We'll fine tune the forecast as we go forward, but it's just one of those weather systems which makes it really tough to pin down the details of uh, this late out. So we'll continue to keep you posted. Big takeaway though, don't put away the winter wardrobe for the weekend. <laughs> yeah, Lower boy. to mid 60s and also don't stow the chains away because you mm. may need them if you travel in the mountains over yeah. the weekend. It's Good been advice. so nice. I've been tempted to bring the patio furniture, the cushions <laughs> back. Know. Out. Like, no, not yet. Well, not yet. Like, yeah, no, I keep wondering to wash it in the car. Yeah, not yet. Not yet. It's coming.